her and then shot at her. Heifer didn't realize that she'd been hit when she pulled over and called 911. Glad she's going to be all right. So here's the story of a dog that risked its life to save a couple trapped in a riptide in California. So smart three-year-old Nico was. Uh, Nico was at the beach with his owner, a former lifeguard. The dog saw the swimmer struggling in the water and, you know, without hesitation, raced in after them. He went right out to her, right up to the side of the boogie board, and he swung his body around while he was swimming. And I just said, grab him anywhere you can. And she actually... Put her, put her arm right around his, almost his chest, and she's hanging on the boogie board with on, one arm. Nico's owner adopted him from a shelter just two months ago. Um, as far as he knows, the dog has zero training in rescues and just acted on instinct. Go, Nico. 44 minutes past the hour. Um, Michael Sam, the first openly gay football player to be drafted into the NFL, is still looking for that chance to play on a team in the season. So Brian has more on that. The scouts were taking a look at him again. Taking a look at him. He's at the Veterans Combine. Uh, he, he didn't look too bad. A little slower. Sam was uh, one of 105 free agents going through drills in front of scouts at the NFL's first ever Veteran Combine in Arizona. Michael Sam has yet to play a down in the NFL and is doing everything he can to make any NFL team. He was a tad slower than his scouting combine 40-yard dash last year. Not sure how that will affect him. Sam refused to answer any questions non-football related, especially the question asking if being on Dancing with the Stars will affect his chance to make a roster. If Sam doesn't make the NFL, he hasn't ruled out the Canadian Football League. Kurt Busch was on track to take his first checkered flag after returning from his three-race suspension, but too late. Caution flags cost him the victory. Bush started the race from the pole position and led 65 of the 209 laps. Not bad, but in the final lap, he got overpowered by Brad Keselowski, who had not, he, he, only, he didn't lead a single lap the entire race. Bush missed the first three races after being suspended for domestic violence allegations. So after four days of nonstop basketball action, we have the standings, and it's not looking too good for me. Jen's leading the pack with 45 Woo! points. Bob is second with 42. <laughs> Galanos is third. Robin, you're not you're you're sitting at 40, but you're not doing too bad because you still have the most points still available. You could t you could still win this whole thing. But if it goes like it's gone in the past, with all these crazy upsets, um, I don't know. It's funny to me because um, the entire network sports-related anchors yeah. are doing the worst. Yeah. <laughs> Because yeah. you went with what's logical. <laughs> you know, I was out sick, right? I mean, mine are computer-generated brackets. I'm doing that next year. I'm pretending <laughs> to be super proud, but I yeah. never Here's where auto picks, that. honey. <laughs> those are the people with the lottery. I the auto picks. Over is what I want. I think you should be able to have a do-over. Did I see Charles Barkley on there? Yeah, he's. I think. Uh, he's way at the bottom. Way at the bottom. <laughs> All right, genetically engineered apples and potatoes could be headed to your local grocery store, um, but will you be able to tell the difference between them? And then some people are claiming that Pope Francis was part of a miracle. Now, there are some that doubt it, but see what you think for yourself. The Bleacher Report, brought to you by CenturyLink, your link to what's next. It's more than a network. It's how you stay connected. With CenturyLink as your trusted technology partner, you get an industry-leading broadband network and cloud and hosting services. CenturyLink, your link to what's next. With psoriatic arthritis, I had intense joint pain that got worse and worse. Then my rheumatologist prescribed Embril. I'm Phil Mickelson, pro golfer. Embril helps relieve pain and stop joint damage. I've been on the course and on the road. Embril may lower your ability to fight infections. Serious, sometimes fatal events, including infections, tuberculosis, lymphoma, other cancers, nervous system and blood disorders, and allergic reactions have occurred. Before starting Embril, your doctor should test you for tuberculosis and discuss whether you've been to a region where certain fungal infections are common. You should not start Embril if you have an infection like the flu. Tell your doctor if you're prone to infections, have cuts or sores, have had hepatitis B, have been treated for heart failure, or if you have symptoms such as persistent fever, bruising, bleeding, or paleness. Embril helped relieve my joint pain, but the best part of every journey yeah! is coming home. Ask if Embril, the number one biologic medicine prescribed by rheumatologists, can help you stop joint damage. You're a hard-working professional with big aspirations. An advanced degree could help you get where you want to go. But sometimes your career can feel like it's getting in the way of your career. 
Now Capella University offers FlexPath, a revolutionary program that puts you on the most direct path, leveraging what you've learned on the job and focusing on what you need to know so you can earn a degree at your pace and graduate at the speed of you. FlexPath from Capella University. Learn more at capella.edu. Closed captioning brought to you by Progressive. Visit Progressive.com today. I saw a commercial that said you could save $500 by switching to Progressive. That was me, Mom. <laughs> I thought you said that was me, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> on HLN. A lot of times I'm pretty serious with my kids, but driving and doing donuts with Kylie, it was fun. Beautylicious Offline premieres tomorrow at 10. That's making me dizzy. Because you know I'm all about that bass, about that bass, no trouble. At Lee's Toyota, the only thing falling are the prices. I'm Cindy with Lee's Toyota, and welcome to our white tag sales event going on now. Shop our three large showrooms in one location, and the price on the tag is the price you pay. You'll get a lot for a little with no hassle, just honesty and integrity. The foundation of Lee's Toyota for over 50 years. Don't wait. Get here today and see white as you save some green. The white tag sales event. See what a great deal really is at Lee's Toyota. You better believe it. Getting to the airport can be stress-free. Just call the 7-7s of Dial 7 Car and Limousine Service and let us get you there on time and smiling. Whether you're going to LaGuardia, Kennedy, Newark, or riding around town, Dial 7 saves you time and money. We've got a bold new look, and we're the best ride in town. Dial 7 Car and Limousine Service, 777-7777. It is 10 minutes to the hour. Today, police plan to release the results of their investigation into an alleged sexual assault that Rolling Stone magazine reported on at the University. A University of Virginia student named Jackie claimed that she was brutally raped by seven men during a fraternity party. University officials who acknowledged that they did know some of the details of Jackie's story months before the Rolling Stone article published, they asked police to launch a criminal investigation. Now, long before this criminal investigation concluded, a few important things happened. First, Rolling Stone apologized for its reporting when it became clear that there were discrepancies in the woman's account. Second, friends of Jackie told CNN that they were with her that night and that she told a very different story of what happened. They also showed us emails and text messages that appeared to show that Jackie had fabricated the man who she says orchestrated her rape. And police cleared the fraternity where Jackie said the alleged rape had happened. But police have always left open this possibility that Jackie was raped somewhere else or on a different night. Now, it's important to remember that the police investigation is separate from the University of Virginia's internal investigation into whether they handled Jackie's claim and other reports of sexual assaults correctly. Sarah, thank you. You know, Rolling Stone plans to publish an external review of its disputed article, and that's in the next few weeks. A cardinal says that a vial of dried blood kissed by Pope Francis partially turned back to liquid. Many Catholics say that it could be a miracle. It was during a ceremony in Naples, Italy, the church says the blood belonged to Naples' patron saint, Gennaro. But some skeptics say that it liquefied because of a chemical reaction inside the vial when you move it from a vault. Genetically engineered apples and potatoes that don't bruise or turn brown. <laughs> now, long before this criminal investigation concluded, a few important things happened. First, Rolling Stone apologized for its reporting when it became clear that there were discrepancies in the woman's account. Second, friends of Jackie told CNN that they were with her that night and that she told a very different story of what happened. They also showed us emails and text messages that appeared to show that Jackie had fabricated the man who she says orchestrated her rape. 
and police cleared the fraternity where Jackie said the alleged rape had happened. But police have always left open this possibility that Jackie was raped somewhere else or on a different night. Now, it's important to remember that the police investigation is separate from the University of Virginia's internal investigation into whether they handled Jackie's claim and other reports of sexual assaults correctly. Sarah, thank you. You know, Rolling Stone plans to publish an external review of its disputed article, and that's in the next few weeks. A cardinal says that a vial of dried blood kissed by Pope Francis partially turned back to liquid. Many Catholics say that could be a miracle. It was during a ceremony in Naples, Italy. The church says the blood belonged to Naples patron saint Gennaro. But some skeptics say that it liquefied because of a chemical reaction inside the vial when you move it from a vault. Genetically engineered apples and potatoes that don't bruise or turn brown? Well, they're headed to your grocery store shelf possibly soon. So Jen knows that the FDA says this stuff is completely safe. Other people are saying you modified it so it looks prettier. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> Could you at least label it so I don't have to eat it? <laughs> good morning. Yeah, good morning. The FDA has officially signed off on these genetically modified apples and potatoes. They're still deciding, though, on whether they need labels so that you can make your own choice if you want to eat them. Now, the most famous that you've probably seen is the Arctic apple. So I say in your mind, if you want to remember this, just remember if you see a snowflake and an apple, oh. no. <laughs> if you're against them, or maybe you want to try it, but that's how you'll know those, this is the one. Now, it was designed in Canada. That's why it's called Arctic. It was designed there. But the one that's um, likely to come to your table is actually not the apple, even though that's the most famous. It's the potato. It's by J.R. Simplot. Um, by the way, McDonald's uses J.R. Simplot, but they've said they do not source their GMO potatoes. But I can see, say you are a caterer and you're mm. making these beautiful displays and you cut up an apple and you've got it all into a flower and it turns brown. So I can see it. I can Ooh. see it. All right. The Wall Street Journal has your fashion tip this morning, Robin. Oh, yeah? They have declared... The Wall Street Journal does. Oh, yeah. Because, you know, guess who the fashion people read besides Vogue? They read the journal for the business end. Uh -huh. They have declared the end of the it bag. And they say it's partly because of Instagram. They say social media has made the fashion world a lot more street smart. Um, it takes a lot of inspiration from things like Instagram and no longer dominated by a few magazines. And in the same way, there are many, many brands getting into big purses. So they say it's just no more about like the special Fendi baguette that was in Sex in the City. So in other words, there are many it bags now, just not one. So now they say it's an eye bag because it's about you. Okay. It's I say it's the same. I say it's the same thing as the um, iPhone, except for women, right? The guys have to have the latest one. <laughs> <in terms of laughs> yeah, the Gary Bradshaw <laughs> thingy. Okay, I gotcha. Ten, thank you. A hundred U.S. troops have been warned that they could be the target of lone wolf attacks. That's after officials say a, a group that supports ISIS may be putting this information out. Well, I usually get the rough and bumpy skin and the backs of my arms. Gold Bond Rough and Bumpy Skin Therapy. Used daily, it exfoliates, smooths, softens. Reduces bumps 72%. Just nice and smooth. <laughs> Gold Bond Ultimate Lotion, Ultimate Skin. Non-attorney spokesperson. This is a medical alert. If you have severe complications from surgery using transvaginal mesh, please call us immediately at 1-800-BAD-DRUG. You may be entitled to substantial compensation. Problems include mesh erosion, severe pain, additional surgery. Recent verdicts and settlements total several billion for transvaginal mesh injuries. You may be entitled to substantial compensation. For a free consultation, call 1-800-BAD-DRUG now. You've been part of the family for as long as I can remember, and you just mean so much to all of us. The holidays wouldn't be the same without your crescent rolls. <laughs> we got you a little something. We got you jeans. It's about time. Pipe and hot. up there Fizes is our brother away from our families making sacrifices 
but not nearly as many of our sacrifices as our brother and brothers and sisters worldwide. Now, we've been doing Salute to the Troops, gosh, for 10 years now. So if you feel so moved, just like he did, to get your Salute to the Troops out, even if you are a member of the military, go to hlntv.com slash Robbins, the least we can do. All righty, would you rather get your health care through Obamacare or pay the fine for not having any? You know, Jen's back, missed you. Um, and she knows that many Americans, even with extra time to enroll recently, have opted to take a hit instead, and more on why. Yeah, and they had this special enrollment period that they were going to leave it open all the way till April 15th, but some of the tax prep firms are saying, people are saying, I'm still going to take the penalty. It's still cheaper for me. That's what H&R Block says, that they're the ones who sit down with you and you get that final choice, you know, are you willing to take this hit in your taxes or do you want to sign up? But for some people, it just still makes sense financially. One example is a retired worker in Florida who said, hey, it's $250 penalty compared to nearly $10,000 a year for insurance. So we'll see if this special enrollment period helps anybody else extra sign up. But it looks like not so many. The fines do get bigger next year. She's making a move. Taylor Swift went out and bought sites like taylorswift.porn to do so before somebody else did. And who knows what they might have put up. The nonprofit that allows for site naming is allowing suffixes like dot porn, but that means that a lot of businesses or people trying to protect their own name have to go out and buy these extra sites, or who knows what's going to end up there. A 12-year-old is under arrest today. She's alleged for plotting to poison her mom not once but twice because her mom took away her iPhone. What? <laughs> Sir, we're going to need you on the runway later. Don't let a severe cold hold you back. Get Theraflu with the power of three medicines to take on your worst pain and fever, cough, and nasal congestion. It breaks you free from your toughest cold and flu symptoms. Theraflu, serious power. Non-attorney spokesperson, this is a medical alert. If you have severe complications from surgery using transvaginal mesh, please call us immediately at 1-800-BAD-DRUG. You may be entitled to substantial compensation. Problems include mesh erosion, severe pain, additional surgery, Recent verdicts and settlements total several billion for transvaginal mesh injuries. You may be entitled to substantial compensation. For a free consultation, call 1-800-BAD-DRUG now. When Lakita.com sends a ready-for-you alert the second his room is ready, you know what salesman Alan Ames becomes? I think the numbers speak for themselves. I'm sold. A selling machine. Ready-for-you alert only at LQ.com. You totaled your brand new car. Nobody's hurt. But there will still be pain. It comes when your insurance company says they'll only pay three quarters of what it takes to replace it. What are you supposed to do? Drive three quarters of a car? Now, if you had Liberty Mutual new car replacement, you'd get your whole car back. I guess they don't want you driving around on three wheels. Smart. With Liberty Mutual new car replacement, we'll replace the full value of your car. See car insurance in a whole new light. Liberty Mutual Insurance. It's difficult for you to find the perfect pair of shoes in your All right, we're happy to oblige. Just go to hlntv.com slash Robin. Why not jazz up dinner tonight? Saturday taste so right. Red beans and rice, jambalaya too. Chemical polishes can create a waxy mess. Finally, there's...
Imagine instantly and effectively removing any unwanted fat from your body. With body contouring from Sonobello, it's possible. It's why more than 35,000 men and women have trusted Sonobello for targeted fat removal that's more convenient and more affordable than it's ever been before. Sonobello was the catalyst to get healthy. I have the body that I had in my 20s. Sonobello physicians specialize solely in body contouring. And it's how we achieve such incredible results for our patients time after time. You can have the slim, toned, sexy body you've always wanted. I love my Sonabella body. My husband loves my Sonabella body. <laughs> now it's easier than ever to get your sexy back with Sonabello. Call 1-800-662-6517. Or go online now for a free, no-obligation consultation. Learn how quick and affordable your procedure can be. Call 1-800-662-6517 for a free consultation or go online now. Well, a brave little 12-year-old boy used code to help police catch the man who allegedly broke into his house. He was able to call 911 and use his keypad to give police more information. Okay, 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 Luke. Look, listen to me. Listen to me. I'm going to ask some questions, and all I want you to do is press either one for yes, two for no. You're doing an excellent job. You're doing an excellent job. Can you still hear him? Just press one for yes, two for no. How fascinating and scary to be that little boy. He heard a window smash, hid in the closet of his bedroom, obviously didn't want to make any noise. Cops caught a 33-year-old suspect after a foot chase. Police say the man had broke into several homes in that neighborhood. So a guy's Jeep is being towed with him in it. He floored it, drove right off the tow truck. Oh, he was mad. Come and look at this video from Chicago. The guy who recorded it says the driver kept yelling, I'm in here, I'm in here. I thought you weren't supposed to drive away with somebody in there, but it's not clear why the Jeep wasn't secured to the truck. The tow company, yeah, refused to comment. Nobody's identified the driver of that Jeep. Somebody's got to have a plate, right? <laughs> All right, what looks like a preemptive strike before today's big media availability? The Final Four coaches just released a joint statement on Indiana's controversial religious freedom law. And Brian is in with more on that. Brian. Hey, good morning, Jen. Yeah, all the coaches, they want to, they want to focus on, on the games at hand. On Monday, Duke head coach Mike Krzyzewski told the press he wouldn't talk about social issues. So in an effort to avoid... New this morning, doctors in Colorado are monitoring a patient with Ebola symptoms. Now, they say the person is considered low risk, and they expect to have test results later today. The patient now is in isolation at a hospital. Health officials say this patient recently got back from a country dealing with an Ebola outbreak, so taking all precautions there. And French investigators are still denying there's any cell phone video from inside the plane that crashed into the Alps. But French and German media are standing by their reports that video from phones found at the crash site show German Wings Flight 9525's final moments. Now, meanwhile, CNN's Aaron McLaughlin reports searchers at the site are having to dig underground for clues. Well, the recovery work, at times painstaking, dangerous, and emotional, continues here in the French. Closest friends forcing back tears. Oh, I think it's amazing. After an exhausting fight, six year old Ella finally got her dream playhouse. She's sick all the time. This is her getaway right here. Swing a bright spot in the yard and in Ella's world. 
I'm going to go ahead and thank the Homeowners Association for finally making that change. Ella's family says she's responding well to her treatment for leukemia. So Amazon wants to put buttons all over your house to make it easier for you to buy stuff. Yeah, Amazon Dash. It looks like the real thing. I am so intrigued. Maribel, tell me more. Good morning. Well, we didn't report on this yesterday because a lot of people thought it was an April Fool's prank, but apparently it's not. Amazon Dash is the new service. These are oval buttons with brand names on them for household items like detergent, toilet paper, trash bags, even food. So when you're out of something, you press uh, that button and it sends a signal over Wi-Fi to an Amazon mobile app, which then places the order. Now, this is being tested in just a handful of places right now, and it's only for Amazon Prime subscribers so far, Amazon has another device that works the same way, except it scans barcodes and then sends that information to your Amazon app. One area where the economy is booming, the market for vacation homes. In 2014, sales of vacation homes were up almost 60% over the year before. Beachfront homes were the most popular. Vacation home prices dropped last year, and folks have been snapping up those good bargains. But there's a flip side to this. Sales of primary homes dropped last year. Back to you. So the song Uptown Funk by Mark Ronson and Bruno Mars, the most popular song of the decade. That story is trending. There's a little dance video available of that, courtesy of the show. Just got to hunt around on the internet for it. All right, Turkey wants less of Julianne Moore, the Oscar-winning actress. Well, she shot a promotional film for Turkey's tourism ministry last year, but uh, the government wasn't. to you. Sandals. This is Liz. She recently enrolled at CTU. Why? Because they've got a way for her to use her experience to earn her degree faster. You see, CTU has something called Fast Track, so she can prove what she knows to earn credits in hours, not months. And since many courses offer Fast Track tests, she can turn more of her skills into lots of credits. Now she can save more and graduate earlier. Fast Track. It made a difference for Liz. Now see what it can do for you. CTU. Are you in?